Hey, this is Dominique, and I wanted to um, go over um, how to use the uh, Web Aim Web, web Accessibility uh, Checker, Color Contrast Checker. Um, so you can use it to um, check the color contrast on some of your some of your documents. Um, I have a document open here that's for uh, um, I think it was Patricia. Um, but yeah, this is one that she was working on earlier. So I'm just going to show you because um, we're checking the color contrast between the um, the letters and the background behind them. So all we have to do, we check the foreground. Foreground uh, is in reference to the letters. Okay, so you click click this color box right here, and it'll open up. Sorry, it's opening on my other screen. Open up a color picker thing. And what you do, you see this little uh, eyedropper, you click the eyedropper, and then you go over and you, you notice it doesn't have to be in the web page, it actually opens, it'll open over in a document or anything else you got open as well. Um, but you hover over where the color is, and you choose it for your foreground, and then um, you go over to the background color, and you choose your eyedropper again. And notice it pops up the little magnifying glass and we don't want that color we want the background which is black so notice i'll put this over here the contrast ratio is 12.44 to 1. Um, notice this pass 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 um, wcag2 is the aa requires a contrast of 4.5 to 1 for normal text and 3 to 1 for large text and a contract ratio of 7 to 1 for normal text. Um, so anyway, ah, here's a, yeah, this is for um, checking color contrast uh, for uh, web pages. You can attach, you can um, use a Firefox plugin or there might be a Google Chrome in, uh, extension for Colorzilla. That's what I usually use, but this thing seems to work pretty easy uh, and it works on stuff outside of the web page. So I think I'll probably stick to that. So for instance, I did have a concern about this color down here, May 2017. So I figured, okay, well, why don't we check that too? And so we can go here and do the foreground color, choose our eyedrop tool, and this is the color of the text and then our background color choose the eyedrop tool and just get the color of the background and as you can see 7.7 .7 to zi uh, to 1 and so that passes um, so that's how you can check your color contrast using the web aim um, color contrast checker it says uh, webaim.org resources contrast checker thanks